All right, back over to um, my little item here, which I teased earlier, that I want to I want to ask Roxanne about her body. And th- this is not an HR complaint. You are you fit the profile. First of all, you're a woman. Uh, hold on, let's let's do a gender test on that. <laughs> Just like the Olympics. Let, 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 <laughs> let's do an Olympic boxing gender test. Okay, yeah, she passes. All right, all right, barely, but right. she passes. Mm, barely. So Roxanne. You are a woman. You're also a white woman. Mm. So this is Boy. why I'm kind of gearing this. You're you're the only woman on the show. So yeah, you're, pro- you're profiling. And, profiling. And, and you are a white woman. And the reason why I'm asking you this question, I'm not trying to sound like creepy at mm-hmm. all. Okay. I have an item I saw over the weekend. And the headline was white women less confident about their bodies than other women, according to research. So other ethnicities are not as self-conscious about their bodies. White women have the most self-consciousness of of mm. all the ethnicities. I think Roxanne might be the wrong white woman to ask. Why is that? Yeah, why? I think we should get line up, line up a bunch of three hundred pound white women, <laughs> and and then ask them look, of all different it, races. This, look, hold on, listen. White women are less confident about their bodies than women from other cultures. Okay. Researchers have found that there's greater media pressure for white women, or there's a perception that white women feel there's more pressure to be in shape or look a certain way than other women, uh, like black women, uh, Asian women. This is a study which was conducted uh, by Durham University psychologists. They looked at the impacts of age and sociocultural pressures on body appreciation. And it turns out that it's white women that have the biggest problems with their bodies and they're the most susceptible to the world around us and the pressures for body image. You know, it's funny. Last night, Daviana, this just happened. She was walking around the house and she pulled her underwear up in her butt and is like, What? Well, you, you know, well, like, this, this, this is like, yeah, I don't want to hear four. about your five year old kid uh, well, pulling okay. up underwear in her butt. I'm sorry. What are just you doing? Her. So she was like, Look at me, look at me. I'm mom and so and so. And she named my other friend. She's like, this is how mom and, and Jill, we'll call her Jill. This is how mom and oh, Jill wear th- their bathing th- oh, suits. thong bikinis. I don't have a thong. Oh, but you're, you know, you're a butt flosser, I've heard. No, I not at this stage in my life. I'm really not. I can promise you that. You never know, but, but right now, not really. But, you know, it just is the cut that, uh, you know, if you wear a bikini, yeah. the cut is usually up your butt a little bit more <laughs> than a traditional, like a kid's cut. It covers their cheeks as it should. So she's making fun of me. And I was just like, well, the husbands like it. You know, that's why, like, I'm trying to reference, like, dad Dad likes me in that bathing suit, so that's fine. Uh, so to answer your question, I still wear bathing suits like that. And yeah. I'm okay with I don't care. Like, I'm, okay. I don't care. I can but, tell you with 100% certainty, MJ, the story you just read is 100% correct, and my proof is a carnival cruise. <laughs> <laughs> That's all I'm going to say. If you've ever been on a carnival cruise, you know what I'm talking about, and you know that that story is true. Oh, man. Every every ethnicity you can possibly imagine, uh, right. having the time of their lives right. and the skimpiest clothes, every size and, the Lord has created. But you think that the white women are more... I, I'm saying... Self-conscious? I'm just saying... I can see facts in that story. Only frame of reference, Carnival Cruise. You, let me take a Carnival Cruise. Yes, okay. Roxanne. I, I was going to do a segue there. But uh, okay, go, go I got to tell you. Let yeah. me who, let me tell you who trumps all of this. You want to talk about a culture with attitude about their bodies? Eskimos. Oh man, they don't give a bleep. Well, Eskimos and Italians. Oh my gosh, you go to Capri, the beach there. That would, that would be Capri. Capri. And I'm telling you, they just have like this, the women, they have this jiggle to them that is super sexy and confident. And they like, I, I'm like, how do you walk and have your boobs 
boobs jiggle like that. Like it doesn't matter what size they are. And then it doesn't matter if they have cellulite. What They are on the beach. Everything is available to be seen. There Everything is at the buffet. Okay.